just speaking of that, I just would really like to introduce everybody to Rudy since we've got all this extra time. Yeah, I mean, we might as well. He's, right, he's so, a, so I Rudy, mean, he is probably our closest friend of the show, right? As he, as, he hangs out in the parking lot most nights. Yeah. Uh, most nights, some nights he's very enthusiastic. If we have a guest in here that he really digs. Yeah. Uh, but many nights he's out there just smoking an S load of pot. Right? Yeah. He smokes blunts that look like tampons. He, he, he is huge, not. Yeah. He's not listening to the show right now. So is there anything we need to warn people about? Well, tell them the story a little bit. Rudy is a friend of mine. I mean, he's a guy I've known for a long time. He's a cholo from East Los Angeles, uh, born and raised in Boyle Heights. He, spent some time um, in prison. Well, he spent over half his life in prison. Yeah. He's in his early 40s. He's been in prison well over 25 and years. he's got a wife and, and a bunch of kids. Yeah, and, a bunch uh, of kids. So uh, uh, He's got a wife, sad girl. And uh, he has never left Boyle Heights except to uh, go to jail. So, I mean, that's Rudy in a nutshell. But he's got a heart of gold. Wouldn't you say, Drew? He, he, I, I like Rudy. I've always yeah. liked Rudy. So, Rudy. Let's, uh, let's get Rudy. 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 Oh, here he comes. Okay. Hey, what's up, Doc? Hey, Rudy. How's it going? Hey, like, uh, you know, I'm just like, uh, I'm kind of like, I'm a little confused because, like, I mean, you're not, like, talking to nobody on the No, on I the know. We had, we, had some phone, we had some phone trouble. So we thought this would be a chance to introduce you to uh, everybody. We have a lot of new listeners tonight. Where at? Like, uh, oh. like El Monte? No, or, not El Monte. Like uh, San Bernardino? No. Uh, how about, like, um, Amarillo, Texas? KZ, KZRK? Oh, Rock damn, away. dog. I used to buy some weed from, uh, from like, uh, El Paso. Uh, Is that, like, close uh, there? I don't know. We have Cincinnati, Ohio, WFTK. I remember Rock. one time, like, uh, I played Circle Jerk with a food stamp in San Antonio. What? That's right. It was me, Lil Maniac, uh, Creeper, Joker, and, like, we were in a hotel room in, in San Antonio, Doc. Yeah. We went to see the Lakers play oh, no the kidding. Spurs in 1999. Take a bus down there or something? What'd you do? Yeah, Greyhound, Doc. Yeah. And, like, uh, so, like, we only had one food stamp left, and we were, like, all perved up, like a Bacardi and, like, smoking blunts like crazy, Doc. And so we decided to do, like, soggy biscuit with a food stamp. Oh, my God. It was crazy. Hey, listen, I, I was trying to explain to our new listeners about your experience in prison and, uh, you know, your thing with your cellmate, tr- Trucha. Is that his name? That's right. Tr- trout? They call them the Trout. I never learned why, Doc, but they call them Trucha and, like, um. Uh, he was nice to me at first, but then he blasted my butt like real hard. Like he was, like he raped you. I guess, like you could call it that, but like he just did my butt all good. And it kept going, right? Well, like for what? I like I told you, dog. I got like Stockholm butthole. Oh. Like, cause I start. What are you laughing at, dog? No, cause like um, I started to like 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 it, or yeah, like yeah. I got convinced, like. I feel like his pito and my culo like brainwashed my dome to yeah. think like I needed it. Dog. Do, do, do he give you drugs for that? No, nah, dog. I just no like no. Nah, after a while, like you know, I used to like bite the. Uh, I wasn't biting the pillow. I was biting the sack of rice because we were in the kitchen. Yeah, dog. yeah. But like um, and then like uh, I I I just learned to like not bite it. I would just like kind of grin, you know, and like I was sure because he used to have a gold tooth. And every once in a while, I look at my reflection, dog, and like his gold teeth. I look back, you know, because yeah. I'd be bent over. I look yeah. between my legs sometimes. Okay, okay. I move my huevos. Okay, and I see. Okay, okay. So, Rudy, here's the deal. We, uh, we, we have now some calls. Mm, Thank you oh, for joining us clean, explaining eh? your stuff. Hey, I just want to say, like, um, to all the listeners all over the world, like, up in Canada or whatever, and, like, New York, like, um, Nueva York, like, uh, Atlanta, dog, like, the Dirty South, dog, or, like, whatever's in Minnesota where your 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 urine, it freezes sometimes, yeah, sometimes if it gets yeah. too barato, you know? Yeah. I just want to say what's up and, like, you know, keep your head up, dog, because like thug life can get crazy. All right, and you'll you'll share your stories with our audience as we go a little bit. All right, some, okay. All right, all right. But you, you seem a little tired tonight, by the way. No, I get my kids kept me up all night, dog. Yeah. All right. All right we'll talk uh, about that. All right, yeah. Mike, in here, Mike, Mike. Hey, buddy. Hey, dog. Real quick. What? You know what's crazy? What? Barry Manilow's white. Yeah. Damn, I never knew that, dog. What'd you think? Oh, I don't know, man. All right, buddy. See you later. Take care.